The thing that I'm most proud of is, uh, as I noticed through my journey, is meeting the different personalities of the people face to face and being able to meet them on their level and be able to talk with them and communicate with them and um, enjoying meeting someone new that eventually could possibly be your neighbor and not even realize it at the time. But um, I'm, what you say, a people person, so I like to uh, actually get to know my neighbors and get to know the people and uh, extend a, limping, uh, a handout anytime they need a lending hand on anything that uh, they've got going on. So uh, meeting the person directly is really important and has been an important part of Habitat for me. Well, the, the, the value is in the person themselves. Um, to put a dollar figure on it, you couldn't. But uh, say the value, uh, each and every one of us has a, a gift and a talent and a tremendous amount of value within us. It's just realizing that value that we have to offer and going off on that, if you understand what I'm saying. Now that I've began to work on my home, of the other tricks and the trades of the business and of building a home, of things to watch for, things to look at, and things to make sure that it is done right. And to, uh, if you see a problem, uh, draw it to Derek or Adam or one of the guys, other guys' attention, and uh, they're right on the spot to correct it. And that's what I enjoy. They don't say, oh, well, let's let it go and push it aside. No, we're gonna make it right because we wanna make it right the first time. You know, and that's a real core value that I see I'm working on the other homes and then beginning to work on my home to be able to bring that to that. Yeah, and, you know, we keep talking about the people. You know, without the people, uh, what is a home? I mean, a home is a place really until the person actually moves into a home. It's, I don't consider it a home until you actually see people in the home. Uh, the home becomes a home when the husband or wife or the single man or the single lady comes in the home and uh, begin their new venture. And in the beginning of their new venture, they're able to decorate and to put their home to where they come home from a long day's work or a long day from where they've endured in this world and have a place that they feel like they can escape and a place that they can go and relax and get away from the world and it's all its worries and all its troubles that it instills out here today. So uh, definitely uh, the way I look at it, that's when the home becomes a home. It's when the people enter the door and then are moving in to the home. If that makes sense to you. <laughs> challenging part, uh, being the age that I am, uh, You're young, uh, what are you talking about? Ha! Uh, I don't feel as young as I did 20 years ago, put it that way. But anyway, um, the most challenging part, yeah, sometimes is my health. But, uh, we take a, a few Tylenol and have a, a ibuprofen cocktail and keep on going down the road. <laughs> and, uh, uh, as far as uh, a challenge, uh, challenging or adventure to me because I'm the type of person that uh, over the years and my background that God had gifted me with uh, in the mechanic and field was I enjoyed fixing something that someone else could, do, could fix. And I draw a lot of strength from that. You know, I've had it everywhere and they said it couldn't be fixed and they would bring it to me and we would write it out on a piece of paper what had been done, and um, nine times out of 10, we were able to fix the problem. And also try to give them a little education on taking care of their vehicle or equipment or 
simple thing as a push more. I would tell them to take it one step at a time, and I would encourage them that it's a tremendous ministry here in Catawba County, and we're lucky to have it here in Catawba County. Uh, sometimes things come up in life that we can't help, but uh, we have to put them on, I do myself put them on scale, uh, how important it is one through 10. And uh, a lot of times you have to pick yourself up and bring yourself on because it's important that you show up when the other folks are showing up on the job and you're not out there with them. I know myself that uh, it, it always encourages me to see the other homeowners out working, helping me, me helping them, us helping each other. Uh, I get the tremendous value out of that. Okay. Are you interested in joining Habitat? You know, the big thing is keeping your mind and eyes on the big picture. And the big picture is having your own home one day that you are responsible for taking care of. But the most important is owning your own home and um, being a part, feeling like you are a part of this world, you know, for a short time that we are here. But uh, I think a home is an uh, important place that you can, when you're out in the world, that you can say, hey, I have a home to go to. Because there's a lot of folks out here that are not fortunate like we are. And I count myself tremendously fortunate to be in the position I am in right now. Home is a place to escape from all the world's troubles. Once you walk out that door, the world's waiting on you. <laughs>